quick demonstration on my ground control system right here. Um, we're going to be flying the FX61 Phantom. Over here we've got the all-enclosed, very portable ground control setup, setup here. Joystick, which controls all the flight surfaces. Throttle, uh, flight mode switch, auxiliary switches, and a potentiometer here. Um, the brains of this ground control station is the Tyrannus X9E. We've got 1.3 gigahertz video Super Yagi, and we've got the 433 megahertz Dragon Link Yagi set up there. Um, we'll be demoing how everything works in flight, so give me a second and we'll take off. Arming the plane now. Flight check. So if you can see the screen, you can see that as I take the stick all the way to the left, we roll left, take the stick all the way to the right, we bank right, right. I've got throttle here. Uh, you can see it's 26% throttle at the moment, staying fairly level. Um, I can cut the throttle with the throttle arm and advance the throttle, and as you can see, 66% throttle. For some reason, my altitude is not working. All right guys, this is a relaunch. We were having uh, barometer issues. It was not reading correct altitude at all. So we're gonna try this flight demo again. <laughs> Again, uh, we've got full left on the stick, it's, it's a, about a 30 degree bank to the left, we've got right, and obviously pitch, down, so I'll roll to the right for a second and we'll head out and I'll kind of talk about the joystick a little bit, sorry about the train. Alright, so the buttons up here are actually functional. This joystick here is aileron and elevator trim. So going up and down trims the elevator. Left and right trims the ailerons. And then these two buttons here are the rudder trim. So you can actually trim the aircraft in flight with the joystick. Um, on planes with rudder, rudder is controlled by twisting the stick. And I actually use uh, a rudder switch to 
engage and dis disengage the rudder control because it's so sensitive that when you're banking you can actually twist and not even realize it so in the up position um, this is disengaged but then when you flip that you actually have rudder control at that point and that's pretty much going to do it just wanted to demonstrate the flight of the ground station control unit it flies really well. Um, no complaints so far. Both the throttle and the control surface joystick are integrated into this D sub connector, which goes into the box. And then on the other side, we have an external power connection. It's an XD60 connector. We have the 5.8 gigahertz video repeater receiver and then of course the the FPV monitor 12 inch monitor thank you guys for watching uh, let me know if you have any questions uh, thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe